Well, it's actually in Abu Dhabi That's also a pretty interesting company, they build firing ranges. Oh yeah, there is, but uh, there are very tight security measurements, so it's okay. For example, we have to do a test every 48 hours like this. We have to wear a mask all the time, so it's pretty much okay. You know the test? We think we'll do a video about them. There's a lot of footage of these guys being shot at. These are also newly launched, so these are new Caracal rifles. They are based on the AR-15. Basically the assault rifles. No, no, there's no M4. That's a Caracal 816, that's a new one, so they just launched it. I hope you guys enjoy so far. Let's look what else do we have here. Azerbaijan? Yeah, we will look later. Now we are here, we will look later. We'll, we'll be here for four more days, so we'll, a lot of stuff will come. I pretty much like this thing, it's, it's huge, very huge. I 
think this is an anti-ship missile. They use it against ships. This is also a pretty nice thing. I like the design very much. Yeah, I love that too. The interesting fact is this is all made in the UAE, so that's basically their own defense industry and they're showing off pretty much and they're having some pretty great equipment here. So really impressive. The company who made all this was just launched over a year ago and till now they made so much progress it's impossible. You won't believe it, but they did. Yeah, we're streaming. I'm no ruler. Of course I would like to buy a couple of drones here. These ones are also new. They were just uh, announced today and revealed. Let me take a look at specs. <laughs> so this is also a pretty interesting company they basically built this uh, UAV UJV stuff and uh, as said they're awesome so they come up with pretty a lot of new things all of this stuff is produced in the UAE, so they're trying to get sovereignty on uh, their defense industry, not to import so much anymore, and it's working. I think this one I showed before. <laughs> this one is also new I also like this one pretty much because it's basically also a remote controlled UJV. You can see it. Hello, guys.
So you see again the company. I really like this one. It's my favorite here on the show. I don't know why, but it's just impressive for me that they managed to do something so fast. Yeah, this is yeah, exactly, you're right. This is what it looks like. We, uh, Yeah, the problem is it's a time zone problem and also, you know, YouTube doesn't like so channel, you know. YouTube doesn't like so channel. But you can share this video afterwards. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that's a problem because uh, here it's like, uh, I don't know, 3 or 4 o'clock p.m. So that's the problem. Time zone is really a problem. Look here. So this is the only ammunition, ammunition manufacturer in the UAE. So they're basically one of the backbones of the defense industry here. This is held here in Abu Dhabi, in the UAE. No, I can't talk in Arabic. I'm not Arabic. I only knew a few words. Talahon, Talahon. <laughs> More not. Yeah, the problem is really the time zone. However, the video will stay online afterwards, so you guys can watch it or the others can watch it. <laughs> take some, buddy, take some here. See, so I said they're basically the only uh, ammunition manufacturer here in the UAE and with this they're pretty much uh, the, back, the backbone of the defense industry. So one of the backbones, better said. Hello. So Hello back to Azerbaijan. Perhaps tomorrow we will go on one of these because they are outside. Test drive? Yeah, of course, if they let us. Morning. Hello to Australia. Dude, currently I can't send any videos because I'm really busy looking at all this awesome stuff here. Of course we can go to Nimr. I was there before but we can go here. You see the Nimr back there? No, this is not Dubai, this is Abu Dhabi. So here we are at Nimr. No problem man, you're welcome. We will also do a separate video 
I think about this vehicle here and this one so basically we're actually covering this company Edge it's a pretty awesome company they're so so interesting we will do a couple of videos about them but most of the time we will live stream here so tomorrow perhaps we'll look at other companies other uh, displays of uh, equipment but today we are here you eat, they have pretty, pretty good military actually so they're modernized it so they're taking huge step forward yeah edge is local so they're acting global but uh, they're home here in the uae Yeah, we were there before, just check the uh, beginning of the stream. If the stream ends, you will have, can watch the video so you can see everything. So we covered everything. But my favorites are really these drones, these loitering ammunitions. Because they are... Uh, you saw in Azerbaijan what these drones can do to Armenian equipment, so yeah. Yeah, you can use this for recognize, but, uh, reconnaissance, but also you can uh, arm it and conduct combat missions with it. Here, the guy who wanted to see Neymar, this is an uh, UGV, remote controlled. There is a lot of guided ammunitions. Yeah, they export it too, they uh, basically... Uh, Sell it to their own army, but they also export it, yeah. So the company is basically divided into five clusters. One is missile and weapons. The other cluster is mission support. They're doing a lot of mission support stuff. So you can see here. So that's what they're basically offering for their own government and for other entities as well. No, this is made in the UAE mostly. This was also just released today. Thank you. So that's the electrical warfare system. We will look uh, what it has to offer later, tomorrow. This is basically their own intelligence agency. agency. Yes, it's the UAE. It's also a pretty interesting company. So they're doing a hell of stuff. They do cyber security, multi-purpose. It's pretty interesting. They do interrogation training. So they basically show you how to interrogate people properly. So there's some crazy intelligence agency stuff. Yeah, they're all for match. These are all Edge entities because Edge is a pretty, that's the most interesting company this year. That's why we're covering it so much. Edge is really the most interesting company and they have the, the largest stand here, you know? So there's no other company that has a bigger stand. They have exhibited the most things. No, I don't interrogate people, I'm not doing this. But they can do this. Well, we were here at the mission support now. Of course, I'm showing you stuff. And this is another cluster, it's platforms and systems. Yeah. 
Navdex is outside. We can go there tomorrow too. Tomorrow we will be at Navdex. We will stream from there. And Purple and some other companies. So I think this was all for Edge now. Perhaps tomorrow there will be some announcements made. But for now I think that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed it. So perhaps here one more time. Low range sites. No problem, you're welcome. So guys, I hope you really enjoyed it. Tomorrow we will stream again. You can share this video afterwards. As always, like our stuff, comment, share, subscribe. You're welcome, thank you. The time zone is a little bit of a problem, but now you know that we always are online like on this time, okay? We will look what the price is, we will ask everything. We will find it out for you guys. Thank you. Bye bye guys. Till tomorrow.